and what is up guys my name is dr milo back in the video wow and today we're gonna be customizing some cars in grand theft auto 5 to make them look like youtuber cars which doesn't include my car because no one wants to see that sadly Okay guys, so the first car we're gonna customize is the Lamborghini Huracan. That's right guys, this car is like literally kind of every YouTuber's car. Almost. Cause, um, I really don't know why. Okay guys, so the first car is gonna be Jake Paul's Lamborghini Huracan Performante. I hope I said that right. Okay guys, so we're gonna be heading to Los Santos Customs. It's, I think it's just across this bridge. And yeah, just set a waypoint. Yeah, uh, no, no, that one's too far. Yeah, I think this one should be about it. As you can see, this car looks pretty premium. Why? Because it's a freaking Lamborghini, man. It's a freaking Lamborghini. It's supposed to be premium. Okay. And let's hope we don't hit anybody. I'm definitely not gonna hit somebody. In oh, great. Never mind. Expensive repair, but okay. Okay, so let's just avoid everybody in the way and go. Hopefully, I don't hit anyone else. Right now, I didn't hit anybody, and let's just take this turn and safely make it Los Santos Customs. Let's take a left. So, guys, the things we're gonna do is we're gonna give it um, a similar paint job, and then we're gonna get the spoiler on the Parfamante. There we go. And the car's called a Pegasi Waxa Sport. I <laughs> hope I'm saying that right, but I think guys you can get this car for about three hundred fifty thousand dollars on legendarymersport.com. So you you're not likely to find this in free roam, sadly, because nobody actually uses this car in free roam. It's kind of if you're playing in Grand Theft Auto Online, you might find it with another player, but generally everybody's all about the Deluxe right now. I mean, everybody's behind the Deluxe, so, like, literally, just walk outside, you'll find a guy going in the DeLorean. I mean, Deluxe, so. Okay, so we're done with the paint job, and let's get the spoiler. I wonder what it's called. Okay, so, you can see the car is smoking a bit. That doesn't make sense, that happens all the time, you know. But let's get out of the custom shop and I'll let you guys this let you guys decide for yourself if you agree that the car looks like JP's Lamborghini. Okay, let's step outside and give you a view around. Remember guys, it's a Lamborghini. In Grand Theft Auto 5, copyright. They can't get the exact car. I mean, this is the best you're gonna get. Okay? Best. You guys, time for the next car. Okay, guys, so this is the next car. It is in it is a it's 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 a audi audi r8 or should i say no it's definitely an audi r8 so this car belongs to lance stewart that's right guys it belongs to a, another winer slash youtubers you youtuber sorry um and we're gonna customize it to make it look like his r8 Sorry if I messed this up, and yeah, that's it, okay? So let's just safely drive to the custom shop and make sure we reach there in one piece, hopefully. And I'm gonna customize this car to make it look like his car as much as possible, guys. If it doesn't look like that, I'm sorry, but that's what you're getting. Please forgive me. Okay, guys, so we're... Oh, Almost there, I think. And let's just give this 
are customized. So guys, you can get this car in, when you're playing in single player at southernmorsport.com for about a 200 grand or you can get it if you're playing online at legendarymorsport.com for some apparent reason. Okay, don't ask me why. It's Rockstar's decision. Okay, so and after I'm done with that, I might show you the website if I remember. And yeah, guys, you can have a look at the car yourself after I'm done. Let's let's just hope I do it right. Let's go for you know the perfect paint job matching this car. I personally like this car because it's not one of the most expensive cars in Grand Theft Auto Online. You can find this car in free roam also. That's a good thing. We got the spoiler, we got you know, we got almost everything. I mean like you can see the car is pretty much, you know, it's it's a badass. Straight up. I mean, you know, if Rockstar would have removed this car around, you know, today, it would have been a supercar that would cost around I don't know, five million dollars, cause that's what Grand Theft Auto Online is right now. Nothing costs less than a million. Almost nothing costs less than a million. Okay. So we're almost done with the customization. Just gotta you know match the rims to the Audi, Audi. Oh God. And let's leave the custom shop after I'm done with this, and I'll show you around the car. I hope it matches your expectations if not please forgive me and goodbye guys goodbye And the next car belongs to a YouTuber who got his car recently, and that is Movlogs. That's right, guys. I think this is the latest car on our list. It belongs to Movlogs. It's a Rolls R Rolls Royce Phantom, definitely a Rolls Royce Phantom. I mean, it's called something else in Grand Theft Auto, but yeah. Okay. Let's. I'll show you where you can get. You can get SouthernMotorsport.com. Is that what it is? It's gonna be somewhere down in the luxury section. And um, oh, I just missed it. It's right over there. You can see the car costs about two hundred fifty thousand dollars for a car, but this car is actually in real life. I think three hundred fifty thousand dollars, but. I mean the car's not worth it in Grand Theft Auto because it's not that fast, but in real life it's really comfortable and it's worth it. Okay, let's safely make it to Los Santos Customs in Grand Theft Auto. 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 Oh, just forget it. Okay guys, let's just safely make this turn. Hopefully I don't crash the car and have to pay for the repairs. Which has happened a lot this time. Sadly, let's just take a lift and go down. Hopefully, nothing bad's gonna happen. Ooh, just missed that curve, and uh, and I hit the car. Great. Now that's a repair. Okay, that's. Oh my God, there's just so much traffic in Los Santos right now. And we're almost there to the custom shop. We just gotta take this turn, go straight, and then take another turn. Luckily, the custom shop is in Winewood, and yes, here we go. I don't know why I'm drifting a lot. I think you can enter the custom shop in reverse, and you can't. I don't know for some reason the AI doesn't accept your car if it's if if you go in reverse. Why, Rockstar? Why? 
because remember in the previous games you could go in any direction you want but then you didn't have a custom shop you had pay and spray and they would just literally just paint your card the way they wanted it you didn't have a choice and now let's get that repaired let's get that out of the way and those wheels did not match that car like are you kidding me off-road tires on a rolls royce you have to be joking with me man like what Okay, yeah, so let's get the off-white color, so it's not, you know, the other white, it's this white, and guys, trust me. And let's get the rims done, because boy, those rims don't go for that car. And, okay, I think somewhere around here, like, you know, rolls Royce type rims, and this, I think this should be about it. Yeah, this is it. Wait, no. Never mind, no. Let's see somewhere in the high end section. And. No, these are all black. That doesn't suit the car. And it says my controller batteries are low, but it's okay. I think. I don't know which one, but I think they're supposed to be somewhere here. I'm really not sure. You know what? I think it's these, but it's up to you guys what rims you want on your cars, it doesn't matter that much, really. And that should be about it, and let's just go back. First we gotta get the limo tint first, yeah. Definitely the limo tint. It's not the darkest. And let's get out of the car, and I'll show you around. The Rolls Royce Phantom Move Log Station. Okay, guys. Ah, uh, yeah, those are like the car looks pretty expensive. I mean, like, this might be the most expensive car in Vinewood. In Grand Theft Auto Offline, obviously, not online. And then you're not gonna get this car online for, you know, it's, it's definitely not the most expensive car in online, but in offline, maybe. Here you can see the spirit of ecstasy, you can see the car looks amazing and I'll show you the price of the car shortly. Don't be mad at me if it's too expensive, if it's out of your budget, you shouldn't just get any car on this list, just get a Sultan. Okay, and that should be about it. Okay guys, so right now on our list we have rice gum that's right guys we have rice gum's car the one and only range rover evoke the thing about this car is you can find it anywhere in grand theft auto like on the streets or you could buy it online and pay for it from southernmotorsport.com the thing about motorsport.com is in online it's like you know motorsport but then there aren't really that many fast cars on the website compared to legendary motorsport now like, you know i think rockstar should have made a third website where you know they had all the regular cars i bet at this point nobody cares but let's go straight in los santos customs and oh that car kind of looks good it's a comet. A comet. And as you can see, it's called the Baller SUV. Let's get this more customized, and I'm gonna show you the car after it's done, as usual. And then you guys can also see the price of the car. I'm sorry, I didn't show you the price. I mean, like. Oh wait, no, I, I showed you the price the first time of the Rolls Royce, but yeah. I don't get it, like, you can see these, um, the exhaust, it's like, you know, there's just so much smoke coming out the exhaust. And all these cars, when they're in the custom shop, but then, you know, if you, in real life, like, you know, in Grand Theft Auto, if you're driving around, you don't see that much smoke, you know? It's like, not that much smoke on the car, and... Yeah, so yeah, we can get the metal car, and um, yeah, I think that should be about it. Just gotta get those tent though. And those wheels. The 
car is pretty expensive in real life it's about eighty thousand dollars but in the game you can get it a bit cheaper no no wait no no you can't get it cheaper in the game it's it's more expensive in the game it's about hundred twenty thousand dollars okay let's just pull the car over and i'll show you the car no wait, wait no it's not the comet the baller aka rise gums car let's pull over and i'll show you everything about the car and i'll be quiet so that you can admire it yourself and i'll meet you in the next car which belongs to an awesome youtuber we'll get to in a moment And okay guys, it's for the grand finale. This car belongs to Logan Paul. That's right guys, this is Logan Paul's car. The Yeti. It's not customized yet, so it doesn't look like the Yeti, but I'll make sure it does. But the thing is that I could you might say that I could have taken the standard car, which is you know not the 6x6 pickup. But the thing is that the two things are first, they both were G-Wagon. One is a G-Wagon pickup, one is normal G-Wagon. Second one of them was not high ri high raised and this one is high raised. So I took this one. Why? Because I think you know this one matches the Yeti the most. Although it's black yet, but it's gonna be white soon. It's gonna be the Yeti, it's gonna be the snowman, and I almost hit them. As you can see, the car is pretty much higher than every single car around us. You can get this car at the Warstock Cash and Carry website for about $750,000, which is cheap in Grand Theft Auto Online. You can get this car offline for the same price, and the guy just hit me. You won't find this car commonly in free roam because no one uses it, sadly. I mean, like, I use it personally because I think it's a pretty cool car. I mean, you know, for $750,000, it's fast too. In Grand Theft Auto standards, it's actually a bit so, but it's faster than the Vapid LE car that recently came out in Grand Theft Auto Online and costs about the same price. And it's supposed to be the classic Mustang. And I just missed that guy narrowly. And I think I should reach the custom shop any minute now. So, just as I hope not to hit anything, I crash into that guy. So I'm a bad driver after all. Okay, so damn it. I don't really care at this point. You know, 
and by the way guys if if you're if you don't like my voice you can just mute the video and just watch the customization let's scare these guys off because for some reason last time i did it they came to oh they just walked away that's right and last time they called the cops on me <laughs> npc logic okay guys so let's just pull inside the custom shop and go inside the custom shop and get this car done by the way guys if you haven't liked the video by now you should like it why because you obviously are watching this video because you like these youtubers and if you like these youtubers and you like their cars you better like the video too i put a lot of work in this video i usually don't work too hard on my videos you guys might have noticed that from my previous video actually i do work hard this is the one i put the most work into though let's you know get everything done on this car get the license plate get everything get the wheels get the colors get i think you know he has a chrome but then he also has the logo so i'm just gonna keep the original stock fe no not the fenders i mean the grill yeah and, it, and even the bonnet is clean everything is clean on his car he's kept it a lot stock i couldn't i can't i can't obviously get the maverick logo on top and we're almost done let's get this white paint on the car and then that should be about it i mean like you know the car looks it's looking pretty similar right now the, the other color <laughs> you know it's not gold it's definitely black yeah and this is again another color i think black came previously but then i just missed it sorry guys you gotta wait for some time and that was a plane going by los centos sorry guys that was a plane it wasn't me and let's just get this done sorry about that disturbance and the car is almost done, I guess. Or is it? I should have been on a microphone when that plane came over. But I guess. The thing is that, you know, with these other rims, the tires become, you know, a lot smaller. But it doesn't suit the car, so we gotta take one of the, you know, the standard SUV rims. Although they don't match the car that much. You know, Rockstar should just work on that. Yeah. And we're almost done with the car. I'm gonna show you around the car after I'm done. So guys, can we hit 10 likes on this video? It's a small target, but last time we hit 25 likes. Can we get 10 likes? Just smash the record last time. And like, it's really awesome, guys. Okay, so on the left is gonna be my previous video. And then on the right is gonna be a random video. If you guys know that, or you can just read whatever you want. I mean, if you like this car, you can get it on Warsaw Crash and Carry. It's a pretty nice car. It belongs to a very famous YouTuber. And that should be about it. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't worry, guys. I'll show you the car around. But I'll see you in the next one. Take it easy. Don't forget to subscribe. As always. I don't really have a exit line. Um, Dr. Milo's out. Wow.